Which one of you is a poor batansi? Are you put deaf? Who is a batansi here? What do you want with a poor batansi? If you are a poor batansi, you are under arrest for stealing the white man's palm oil. Oh, wow. It was a war of men who took the white man's palm oil, not a war I have never taken anything belonging to anybody in my life. Go to his house and arrest him. A war will you follow us or will get you arrested? Yeah. I will go there. There is no problem. Let me go and get my walking stick. Hmm? Thank you, Father God. We pray you, Father of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, that you will be with us today in whatever we do, that whatever we do today will bring glory to you and blessing to us. We pray in Jesus' name. What is it? Namu Devi sent me to you with a message. Oh, come inside. Come here. What 
is the meaning of this? Why do you invade my palace? Don't you have any respect for me and those I represent? We are very sorry, Your Highness. A man was arrested for stealing the white man's oil. Some villagers overpowered the guards and set him free. We also have it on good authority that you know this man, so produce them. They also looted properties of the Royal Ninja Company. Look, I'm just learning this from you. Uh, can you give me some time to investigate and uh, notify you accordingly? Igwe, we are not instructed to dialogue with you, and we have orders to arrest you if you don't produce the man. How, how do I know the man if I do not send them? Huh? Look, I am a peaceful man, and I detest violence. I am also converted to Christianity. All right. I am ready to go with you. Um, it doesn't know. Okay. Inform the elders. Tell Father Riley that some policemen came here and took me away. Now, let us go. Igwe too was arrested. Yes. Yes. Chimumba just left here. He said Don Juan Rome has been rearrested. And some other glory men. You see what Don Juan Rome has brought on us? You see? You see? I said it. I warned you when Igwe was breaking covenant with the white men. Now look at Agule. Look at Agule. Hello. Agwe. Hey. Let me go home and be sure my husband is still at home. Friend. The white man sent his policeman to come and arrest him. Yeah. What did he do? They accused him of stealing their palm oil. Yeah, yeah. Oh, but everybody in Agule knows that it was Omar Rome that stole the white man's palm oil. Didn't the Koba tell them that? He told them that. Even as he tried to resist them, they shot him in the leg and overpowered him. They have all been taken to Asawa. Yeah. Taking alongside with him. From what I heard about five people in all, including the corporate Chongwa Roma. Also arrested. Ah, what? himself. Yes. He refused to betray those that went and looted the properties of the Royal Niger Company. Yeah. When they went to free Omar Rome. Ah, 
Mama, 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 Please, I'm sorry. I know I brought this trouble on all of us. If I had not gone to steal the white man's oil, all this wouldn't have happened. I'm very sorry, babe. Please. Shut up! Shut up, my son, do you hear? See, see, see where the white man shot me. If they had cut off my leg, what would I have told my chief? that if we ever get out of here alive, I will kill you before we get a glare. Idiot. You will not kill him. An Aguilera man does not betray or kill a fellow Aguilera man for any reason whatsoever. Our ancestors made it a tradition that we be our brother's keeper. If I had betrayed you all, I wouldn't be here. Even if I die in this place, I would have died honorably rather than sell my own people. I am sorry. I will not kill you no more, Rame. But I don't think I will ever forgive you. Hey, Baba. Time is almost. Let us pray that we all get out of this place alive. Igwe, Bonsa Tutuza Glory know that we are here. I gave up the worship of Atutuzu when I accepted Christ at baptism. If Atutuzu were as powerful as we believed, it would have seen us out of here by now. That's true. Hmm. <clears throat> what about the new God of the white man that you serve? Doesn't he know that you are here? He knows that we are here because he knows everything. <laughs> so why doesn't he want you out of here? In his own time, he will see us out of this place. Everything that happens to us in our lives is intended to teach us some lessons. We will be stronger when we get out of this place. That is, if we happen to get out of here alive, Father, it is almost four years 
since you will go and all that glory men we are taken away by the white men i ask when are they going to be released i have made the inquiries and i am told that before long they will be set free father this is our land yes we were here before you came to live with us that's right we have a very proud history ask question and you'll be told what we and our brother from Nteje did to other people bam we can still do same to white man yes if you fly to the reason we were and our brothers have i made the case clear you are i assure all of you that everything is being done to set them free. Every time. We have heard you, Father. Let us go. Please, before you go, let me impart my blessing upon you and your community in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit to bless you and bless your community and all your families and set your prisoners free. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Let us go. This market is big. This fish is very fresh. Uh, this market is very small. This fish is very small. Why are you doing good? Why is this fish? I'm so lucky that I went to buy a new. If not, I could have not even buy anything. We are went late now. I didn't see enough fish. What are you doing at home now? No, no, no. No, we didn't go on time now. Come and buy. Come and buy. Come and buy. My fish is fresh. Okay, like all the same thing. Thank you. Some other time. Thank you. Okay. I think halal today fish is very expensive. I went and buy them by big ones. Thank you. Uh huh. Uh huh. This one. This one. This one. This one. Fish are so small. Come, come, come. Come and buy. 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 This one sells for six pence each. This one three pence each. And this one one penny for each. Can I have this one? Ah, Ndwaya. And this one one penny. You came to buy fish. Can I have this one? This was six pence. This one three pence each. And this one one penny for each. It's very good. Can I have this one? I'll pay you next week. Yeah, yeah. I cannot afford to say on credit. My husband has been away for almost four years now. Whatever I realize here is what I'll use to feed my family with. Why can't you help your fellow woman? Yeah. Huh? Huh? What have you been doing with all this money you have been collecting? What is it will punish you for what you've just said now? It's people like you that go around molesting widows and depriving them of their entitlements. But you must be for all this one day. Hmm? Look at you. You have always looked like a lizard and you will die looking wretched. Hungry man. I am for me. Me? You call me hungry man? Me in blind? You call hungry man? You are a witch. Eh? Yes. That is why you... That is why you look... That is why you look very robust. Eh? Why you have to be put in jail? And I'm sure you will wish that the man die in the prison. Leave Mrs. Tansy alone. Eh? Must every woman cry for you in this market all the time? Eh, Ndwaya? Ah! Ndwaya? You don't even behave like a man at all. Who is even sure that those children belong to you? Useless man. Eh, Gbe? Eh, Gbe? Ndwaya? You are not even ashamed of yourself, Ndwanya. Eh? If you don't leave this place now, eh? If you don't leave this place now, eh? We are going to beat the hell out of you. You are not ashamed of yourself. I will tell you. We all know who is here. Don't cry. Don't cry. No, no, no. I'm telling you, you don't need to do anything to him. I will not cry.
hot water for the past four years. Mm. What will I tell my people? What will I tell Agleri when I get home? Ah! Uh, where? <laughs> you, you, you tell Agleri that only one woman stole oil to eat roasted yam. That is why. Igwe, <laughs> the white man came to my room town, Aguilera, and took me away and has been punishing me. I will tell my children to swear by Otutuz that they will kill the right man wherever they see him. How many white men will they have to kill? That is not the solution. Come here. is to send your children to school so they can learn the white man's ways and they will know what the white man knows that certainly is better than killing them don't you think besides thou shalt not kill to send my children to school. I cannot go to school myself because I am old. Yes, I am already old. So, I will die without taking my revenge on the white man. have to be done. No problem. If you cannot go to school, and if you cannot send your children to school, send them to accept the new faith. Yes. That way they will live with the Reverend Fathers in the Christian village. And they will get to learn the ways of the white man. Hmm? Your Highness, District of Saskot, Sense is apologies. You are now free man. We will accompany you to deliver at our nature. There you will be taking a boat of the Royal Niger Company, back to Aguilera. The deal said he will see you tomorrow morning before you leave. Yeah, <laughs> 
how happy I am to see you again. I know that your prayers kept us alive in prison at Asaba. Ah, I know a lot has happened. As you can see, we have just come back. I must require some time to acquaint myself with the situation here at home. Yes. But I was telling you one thing. <laughs> this thing that has happened to our people will bring the notice of the whole world to Aguilera. Make merry. Dance. Eat. Celebrate. While I go home to see my own people.
Diego and mm -hmm. mm. I've become big fisherman now, especially about Diego. Huh? Hmm. He specializes in ki killing the opo fish. Big opo fish. Tomorrow, you will go to the Christian village and see the parish priest. Hmm? Tell him I sent you to him, to serve him in whatever way he chooses, tomorrow. So you go and get ready against tomorrow. Get your things ready. You will leave first thing in the morning, OK? Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry. You'll enjoy that place, eh? <laughs> 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 Did anybody disturb you in my absence? I asked you a question. Did anybody disturb you in my absence? Ndwanya. Ndwanya called me a witch in the market because I refused to sell on credit. He even threatened to deal with me. 
He said Aguleri belongs to them, not to witches from Teje. Okay. We shall see. Ndoanya, we shall see. Ndoanya. All right. We shall see. How is he? Well, he's weak, but he's getting better.
Tani butani eci baki ko. Awa. Oh. Hmm. Eji kwebi. Ige leano wa maliti auto. Hmm. Gane bivenda. has been added to my family. For four years, the white man denied me my freedom. Four years. There is anger in my heart. For the white man, there is anger. Mm. Why? But the anger will not kill me. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. This child I present to you today shall be called Iwe Bunam. The anger inflicted on me by the white man shall not kill me. me. <laughs> 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 Ah, 
This is his chi. Hmm? It will protect and guide him throughout his life. All right. Make sure that nobody removes it from the head of his bed. Now I'm taking away with them in. He will go now. No. He will No. Nobody removes that chi from the head of his bed. So you now walk with the aid of walking stick. <laughs> Blame it on sickness. I have pains in all my joints. No. Wrestled the way I did when we were young. You won't have all these uh, eggs. <laughs> I am 70 years old, you know. <laughs> this is the real thing. <laughs> From Chetuya, uh, he brought it uh, last night. As payment for some favor I did him last week. Is it wavy? The food is ready. Yeah. You win. Hello. We are fine. Don't mind him. He will always catch me when I am eating. <laughs> Wash your hand, let us eat. Each time I eat roasted yam with uh, palm oil, I remember our home and what the white man did to us while we were in prison. <laughs> <laughs> Have you heard? Ndwanya's wife died yesterday. She was bitten by a poisonous snake and she died before anybody could reach her. I wish Ndwanya died instead. Many, many years ago, while I was away, Ndwanya called my wife. A witch. Hmm. Malikam, if I don't die before Ndwanya dies, I will certainly kill him. I will kill him if I have the opportunity. Otherwise, I am not a Kobatansi. In days, I was called Mbogwaji Okosisi. Ekwaba, times have changed. Leave Ototunzu to handle him. Ma, 
Mano! Nenodi. Anyone who plans to kill me, let him die before the sun rises. May you continue to give me long life and good health. May you continue to protect us from what we don't know. Nenodi, no. Tanodi. Arobunago. How many white men will they have to kill? Sokoba, the best thing is to send your children to school so they can learn the white man's ways. Then they will know what the white man knows. <laughs> Go and pack your things. Tomorrow, I will take you to your uncle, teacher, Oreki. Hmm? Go. Catch you. Certain things we 